Well, Luke, it's been a few weeks since you last saw you on the pitch, but what a way to come back. What a result tonight. Um, yeah, it was, it was good. It's been a few weeks. I, you know, I, I tell it my lungs on, on the pitch today. Um, obviously, late call to start the game. You um, end up being out ill. Uh, but, you know, I, I, always up for a task in front of the deep end. Saracens, you know, the top of the Prem, they haven't lost. Um, and to get the start and to get the performance of the team that we had today, you know, yeah, I, I couldn't ask for any more. How big a result is that tonight, though? Um, it's a big result, mainly because the, the two weeks ago against Gloucester at home, I, I don't think we put in a, a shift that was us. Um, even if we put in a shift and lost the game, it would have been fine, but I just don't think we're playing as ourselves. And today, we didn't do anything magical. We played to what we do, um, and we did what we did very, very well. Um, and yeah, we come out with a win. You were a chief, so it was a very big chief performance today. It, it, numerous times there today, you could have gone for shots at goal, but you went for the jugular every time. Yeah, I think when you got pressure on the side, which I, I thought today we had a bit of pressure on them, and I, I think when you're in the right side, um, Right, right place on the pitch, you can go to the corner. Um, and we did that well, we went to it numerous times and they did defend it really well too. Um, but it just shows the more and more you bat at the door, um, the more chance you've got. We got a penalty try out of the, out of the mall and, and they had a yellow card. Um, and then we went there again and, and got the bonus point try with them all. So I think, you know, even if it's not going so well at the start of the game, um, towards the end, you know, it's paid dividends. Reflect back to May you, and you were one of number boys in that change room and pretty disappointed with that last final appearance. Was there a bit of like payback in that today as well for that result? Um, you could say so. Obviously, league games are, are a lot different. There, there was a time where I don't think we lost the Saris in about four or five games and then we played in the final and they beat us. Um, I, de I do think semi and finals are, are a completely different ball game, which we're normally really good at them. Um, you know, the knockout games, I think that, that's when we play our best. You know, in-season games, we, we expect to win at home. It's, it's, it, we used to be the underdogs for so many years, but I think now uh, we do expect to win at home. Uh, we're that quality side now. The depth in the squad is is, is real good. Um, so I think when we put a, we put a Chiefs performance in, more or not, we, we, we could win. Um, so I wouldn't say it's a payback. I'd say, you know, it's just a stepping stone in the season. You know, we, we've come out on top today. Um, it's going to be a nice Christmas for the boys. Um, and then after that, we just knock it down and we, we go again. You talked about that performance here two weeks ago, and that wasn't a Chiefs performance, was it? And there's a bit of soul searching in the way for that. But... Yeah, I think we were going so well in the season, um, you know, we didn't lose many games um, to start with and it's always the Champions Cup, it's the same side that we played a couple of weeks before that, um, you know, we played Gloucester in the Prem and we, we played we played okay and we, we won the game, we have them in the Champ and we don't play so well, um, I don't know what it is but, you know, it, it's just it's just a little monkey on our backs at the minute, I think the last game at Gloucester um, away, I think we definitely got that off, we performed really well and, and it was just perfect to miss this game, playing well, playing as Chiefs. You know, not worrying about the result, and, and the result takes care of itself. And uh, Rob's just talked about it there. Don't let it slip now. You've got to go to Northampton, recover there after this, and go to Northampton next Friday and, and show that. Yeah, you know, I think a couple couple seasons ago, you know, we lulled on victories like this. You know, Saracens are a top side. To beat Saracens at home all ways is, is big, and you, know, you you could hang on that for a while. And I, I think now we're at, the, we're at the stage now in our in our team's career where we we need to you know win or a loss. The, day, the next day when we, when we do the reviews and stuff, we should drop it there and then, no matter what, like I said, if it's a win or a loss. Um, so I think, you know, we'll, we'll be in tomorrow, we'll, we'll look at the game, we'll see what's gone well, we'll see what's not gone so well, um, and then hopefully drop it there and then look, look, uh, look forward to the uh, next game. Is that a change of the psyche as well, that you look at yourselves a lot more in depth now, that, you know, you question more of yourself, you want more from yourself? Yeah, I don't think it's changed too much, but we, like I said, if we don't get the performance we want, if we don't do the basics, it's normally the basics, you know. Most teams, most teams love the no talent, you know. Um, and I think that's what we pride ourselves on. We come from the champ. We we've been underdogs for many years, you know. Um, even though we got to the final last year, we, we're still seen as a bit of a dark horse, you know. Um, and I just think if we put in a cheese performance, that that is what we do our analysis on. If, if we if we do what we we do, we, we say it quite often and we do laugh about it. If we do what we do and we do it well. Coaches are happy no matter what the result. Um, and I think we've done that today and, and we've come out on top. Okay. Okay. Cheers,